In your globe ceiling fan box, you will find the mounting bracket, decorative canopy, assembled down rod, decorative cover, canopy ring, fan motor housing, LED light kit, glass shade, three blades, receiver kit, remote control, mounting accessories, and your instruction sheet. To install the ceiling fan, you will need a Phillips head screwdriver. Disassemble the down rod. Remove the locking pin, then loosen the shorter screw and remove the longer screws around the hanger ball. Slide the hanger ball off the down rod and remove the cross pin. On the motor housing, loosen the two base screws to allow the down rod placement. Next, feed the wiring through the down rod. Then place the down rod into the fan motor housing and align the holes accordingly. Secure by reinstalling with the locking pin and tighten all the screws until you feel resistance. Next, slide the decorative cover onto the down rod, then add the canopy covering. Ensure it is facing upwards. Finally, add the canopy. Next, slide the hanger ball back onto the down rod and reinsert the cross pin into the large hole. Raise the hanger ball up and nest the cross pin in its groove, ensuring all screw holes align accordingly. Reinstall the longer hanger ball screw, then tighten both the long and short screw until the hanger ball is properly secured. Proceed to install the fan blades. Unscrew and completely remove the plastic protectors from the motor housing and discard. For easiest access to the screws, rotate the motor housing to align the screw below opening. Install the first blade between the two arrows on the motor housing. Ensure blade label is facing housing. Then secure the blade using the included fan blade screws. Tighten well to ensure the fan has no wobble. Rotate the fan and repeat process for remaining blades. Next, loosen any two of the three pre-installed screws on the motor housing and completely remove the third screw. Connect the LED light kit wire to the motor housing wire. Then, line up the two light kit keyholes with the two remaining screws and turn clockwise to lock it into place. Reinstall the third screw and tighten all three screws to fully secure the light kit. Your fan is now ready to be mounted. From the electrical panel, turn off the power and consult a qualified electrician as needed. Using your junction box's pre-existing screws, secure the included mounting bracket to your ceiling's junction box. Then, loosen the mounting bracket's canopy screws. Lift the assembled fan to the ceiling and place the hanger ball into the mounting bracket opening. Rotate the fan as needed to ensure the groove on the hanger ball drops into the slot on the bracket and sits firmly. Then, secure safety cable. Connect the hot black wire from the junction box to the black K1 wire and the neutral white wire from the junction box to the white K1 wire. Secure with wire nuts. Next, connect the junction box's ground wires and all the ground wires from the fan together. Then, slide the receiver into the mounting bracket. Connect the four pin and three pin wires to the receiver. Then, connect the K1 wire to the receiver. Next, lift canopy. Align keyholes to mounting screws and rotate to lock into place. Tighten screws to secure. Raise the canopy ring and align the arrowed slots to the mounting screws. Push the ring into the screws until the screw heads click into the slots and rotate clockwise for it to lock into place. Align the glass shade lip to the LED light plate and rotate clockwise for it to lock into place. Install the remote's back plate to the wall using the included screws. Mount the remote to the magnetic plate. Once installed, turn the power back on from the electrical panel. Turn the switch on. You can now control your ceiling fan from anywhere in the room using the wireless remote. To turn both the fan and light on and off simultaneously, press the GLOBE logo button at the top of your wireless remote. To only turn the fan on or off, press the fan button in the middle of your remote. Once on, you can control the fan speed by pressing the numbered buttons. For directional control, press the relevant arrow buttons. To push cool air down, press the button with the three arrows down graphic on the left. To circulate warm air, press the button with the three arrows up graphic on the right. 
To individually turn the fan's light on or off, press the bulb button located in the lower half of the remote. Once on, you can increase or decrease the light's brightness using the up and down arrow buttons. Use the two up and down sun buttons to cycle through the six available white lighting options. Select the light you need, whenever you need it, with Globe's Ambient Select. Globe, the creative energy company.